Hello, geeks and gamers, and welcome back to Dragon Ball Z. In the last episode, we uh, took on Deborah um, as Gohan. Very quickly realized Deborah is a bit of a challenge, um, but in doing so, Deborah realized that Vegeta had a lot of evil still left in his heart. So Bobbity uh, attempted to go ahead and control the evil within him. Uh, but Vegeta's pride was just too much, and was able to gain the beneficial uh, boost of energy that um, Babidi gave him, while maintaining his own uh, independence. Uh, and that sparked a fight between Vegeta and Goku, um, which gave the last amount of energy that Majin Buu needed to awaken. And at the end of the last episode, Majin Buu did finally awaken. So now we're going to see what becomes of that. Wait, is that thing Majin Buu? Yes, I could never forget that, that menacing face. I mean, this is, this is bad, though. <laughs> so it is Majin Buu, then. That's Majin Buu? <laughs> Hi there, Majin Buu. I'm Bobbity, the son of your creator, Bibbity. You've been sealed in that ball for a very long time, but I've gotten you out! I am your new master! Hey, hey! What are you doing? I'm your master! Don't you ignore me! <laughs> what a buffoon. I'm not exactly sure what happened, but it seems we have failed. Mm. After all that trouble, we have nothing but this powerless sack of fat to show for it. <laughs> you want to challenge me, the great Deborah? Anybody that calls himself great probably isn't. The dreaded demon of destruction, Majin Buu. Which apparently has been recently revealed that uh, Majin Buu did have the potential for uh, God of Destruction. Like, he had the key for it. He just never tapped into it. That, that was incredible! Very good, Majin Buu! His key! Majin Buu's key just skyrocketed! It's huge! He's too powerful. I don't believe this. This wasn't how things were supposed to go. I was confident we could defeat Bobbity and prevent Majin Buu's revival. Yeah, how'd that work out? If only... If only I had known from the beginning that you mortals could have achieved so much more power far beyond that of my own. We could have made use of that method. Maybe if you had actually paid attention to what the hell's that, going that on method? in the freaking you galaxy mean? that you're supposed to to guard. Martin Boo! Or the universe, Listen I guess. To me, Martin Boo! Are you really sure you want to ignore me? I've read my father's notes. I know how to seal you back in that ball. <laughs> yes, yes, good. That's right. Listen, Martin Boo, here is your first order. I want you to kill those two over there. I don't know if I can win, but one thing's for sure. He can't be left alone. If 
kid. All right, well, here. Laura. The body count could reach catastrophic levels. Let's go take him on. Never. Huh. I don't know if we can handle this guy. Ah! Here I go! Ah! Ah! Wow, he is quite a few levels higher than us. Ah! Ah! Now this is beyond the level of super s- ah! <laughs> boo, boo, can you knock it the hell off, please? What? That's not good. Okay, good. I dodged it. What? <laughs> Oh my god. He's 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 tough, I'll give him that. Look forward to seeing how much tougher the booze are gonna be as we continue on. Like, I can't even put distance between us. Now this is beyond the level of Super Saiyan. Is this guy invincible or something? He's actually like one of the first bosses that make me really focus. I'll give him that. He's, he's tough. I mean, Cell was pretty a tough fight, too. I don't know, I'm about to run out of energy. Oh, I'm not even at Super Saiyan 2 anymore. He's unbelievable. Nothing's hurting him. You are this way. You go bye bye. Well, that was rude. Bitch land. Hey, Trunks, which one's the Majin? Beats me. I don't know any of these guys. Uh, uh, oh, and Majin Boo, feel free to finish the Supreme Kai off. Woo! 
hungry. Who eat this guy? Just gonna go ahead and eat him. Debora, you're still alive. Lord Bobbity, this creature, Margin Poo, is not like the others. He will not serve you as your loyal servant. He must be eliminated immediately. Who gotta eat you? You insolent little. It's actually a bit terrifying. Magnificent! Very good, Margin Poo! <laughs> oh, oh, there they go. Piccolo, what's going on? The spell's broken. What? What are you two doing here? <laughs> no shit. What about you guys, what are you doing here? Well, we were statues until just now, but it looks like that creep who spit on us died, and everyone's back to normal. <laughs> I feel like they're just what? <laughs> what is this unbelievable energy? No, it, it can't be. Is that Majin Boo? Nah. Majin Boo, devour this fool as well. Okay, okay. All right, all right. Shut the uh. hell up. Just minutes earlier. Vegeta was empowered by Babidi's spell and more determined than ever, remained locked in fierce combat with Goku. In the midst of the battle, the two Saiyans began to sense a massive energy that suddenly appeared in the distance. Realizing the energy must belong to Majin Buu, Goku pleaded with Vegeta to stop the fight so they could focus on defeating the new threat. Vegeta knew Goku would no longer be able to concentrate on their battle, so he agreed, or so it seemed. It was just a lie to make Goku lower his guard. With Goku distracted, Vegeta knocked him unconscious. Like a bitch. He then made his way to Majin Buu's location, ready to fight the menace he helped bring back into existence. Majin Buu's free because of me, so I'll be the one to get rid of him. I'll settle the score with you after that. That is, if I make it back alive. Right. Super Saiyan 2 transformations to go now available. Face to face. Um, real quick. Can I head out to the world map? First things first. We've got to no. take down. Okay. There's nothing. I was gonna see if I could go get some like sensu beans or something. Gohan's but... energy is already gone. Forgive me. This is my fault. Yeah, Vegeta. That's it, huh? I might as well destroy it while I can. My, 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 my ship! Oh, blast it! What in the world is going on? Hey there! Hello there. Uh, uh, Vegeta, what have you done? I blew up your ship. I don't recall telling you to destroy my ship! So that, that and I don't recall asking you a goddamn thing. Uh -huh. You, 
You killed Gohan, didn't you? <gasps> Gohan. Ugly mug? What's that? It means he thinks you have a strange face. <laughs> now boo angry! I'm not going to hell on my own. I'm taking you all with me. <laughs> Sir, sir. What? What do you Got a gun. I can't believe every single one of them kicked even the day. Big bang! Attack! Pretty sure I dodged that, but sure. Turn me into a candy. Go Super Saiyan 2, what are you doing? Okay, game. It won't let me go Super Saiyan 2. But you're the real cause behind all this, Bobbity. This... this can be! <laughs> oh, no. 
We're about to get Vegeta's atonement. It's actually, like, really sad. Mom. You need to get as far away from here as you can. I'm going to fight Majin Buu on my own. No way! We're gonna fight too! The three of us can take him down for sure! Trunks, I haven't given you a single hug since the day you were born, have I? Huh? Come here, son. Uh... Dad? What are you doing, Dad? Cut it out! You're embarrassing me! <laughs> Take care, Trunks. Huh? Ah! Ugh. Why'd you... Why'd you do that? Why'd you hit Trunks? Same reason I hate you. Take these two as far away from here as you can. I'm counting on you, Piccolo. You're prepared to die, aren't you? Just tell me one thing. If I die, will I be able to see Kakarot in the other world? Oh, oh no. I'm afraid no. not. You've killed too many innocent people. When you die, you'll lose your body, and your soul will be carried off to a different world. I see. That's too bad. Now, get out of here. Hurry! No! Boo, no, let you go! Wait, Majin Boo! You're going to have to defeat me first! You got that? Fight me, you brain-dead balloon! Uh, you say mean things, even though you're weak! I finally know how to get rid of you. Once and for all. Hey! What in the world is Vegeta doing? He's going to get himself killed! For the first time ever, he's finally fighting to protect someone other than himself. Throwing his life away to do it. To make sure you can't put yourself back together, I'm going to blow you into microscopic pieces! Scenes that gives you goosebumps. Here, take these two. I'm going to see what happened. Uh, 
Okay. Now just go around and start blowing all of the little chunks into smaller chunks. So if Majin Buu only takes a small amount of damage, his cells can regenerate. To prevent that, Vegeta sacrificed himself to blow Majin Buu into a trillion pieces. We were saved by him, of all people. the hell did you survive? You're still alive. Guess I'll have to fix that. Don't tell me Majin Buu's fragments. They're... Majin Buu is still alive! and Martin Boo! Reduce this planet to a desolate hellscape, Martin Boo! Kill as many of the Earthlings as it takes to flush those Cretans out of hiding! He's not dead? Martin Boo's not dead? Way Vegeta sacrificed himself for nothing? Yeah, yeah, pretty much. It's not safe here on the surface. Get the kids and everyone else to Kami's lookout right now. These two are the planet's last chance, as slim as it may be. Vegeta, in an uncharacteristically heroic attempt to protect those close to him, sacrifices himself to destroy Majin Buu. Unfortunately, his effort is in vain, and the pink menace reemerges unscathed. Sense Majin Buu's energy, but I can't sense Vegeta's anywhere. Uh, don't tell me. Vegeta couldn't have gotten himself killed. I don't sense Gohan's energy either. What's going on? They're dead. Everyone's dead. Because you needed to take a nap, Goku. Hmm? Piccolo and Krillin are both alive. They aren't stone anymore. Okay. They should know what's going on. I'd bet on that. Where would they be? Hakami's lookout, maybe? Did you forget how your instant transmission worked? Alright, and with that, 
gonna go ahead and end this episode off. If you did enjoy Vegeta's heroic self-sacrifice that ultimately amounted to nothing, then go ahead and do all of those things that we YouTubers ask you to do. And until next time, game on.